Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today in this video, we'll be downloading top five crazy and controversial app you can install on your Android device, and they are completely free. And at this stage, these app are still available to download, and some are different, like from different website as well. And I'll throw everything in the link in the description below. And if you like this type of content, guys, smash that like button, consider subscribing, and I will really want to say thank you to all my viewers and subscribers who's been helping and supporting this channel grow faster. And for disclaimer purpose, these videos are for education purpose only. Once that that's out of the way let's go install some crazy and controversial apps out there let's go okay number one in the list is called a deep six a deep six this is an, a great ai based application you can install on your device let me explain you why this is special and why i'm featuring this on the very first time and this application list so this is an, a controversial app in terms of ai community so this has actually nailed down all chat gpt paid plan i'm talking about chat gpt 4.0 and it has a deep think r1 built in on this so that means if you already have a chat gpt you can pause this video and try to compare it with this one versus chat gpt you already have a limitation on uh, like a version 3.5 if i'm not wrong with the chat gpt and you have a certain limitation if you want to do web search but here you can literally click on the web search and you'll be able to search anything uh, multiple queries at the same time it is a logical form so that means that chat gpt 4 like if you want to write some code and everything like that guess what this is much more effective and free to download right now get your hands dirty so install this one and you'll be able to enjoy all the AI based application in terms of AI uh, for your daily life as well and you can comment down below if you like this application or not or you want me to do a little bit in depth of uh, this uh, deep seek um, or maybe a comparison between ChatGPT versus this one you can comment down below and then obviously I will do this one for you so let's move on to number two and hopefully you can enjoy this application and this is a crazy one trust me once you install it that's what you're gonna know number two and the list is called a silent note so silent note it is a great and very minimalistic note you can install this is by the way open source you can install and yeah, you'll be able to get a something different out of you already have so one thing out of all the notes application you can install this is a privacy focus a note uh, application you can see it has a security encryption as well prevent uh, uh, creating a screenshot you can do a whole lot of things but they look at this UI user interface if you want to go for groceries you can click on that uh, so obviously we're so welcome to this silent note this is a privacy focus as well and again it is a free if you are installing any sort of an application in terms of uh, any uh, note application guess what the only one concern a majority of the people out there they actually say password and note and I know for sure one of you do the same thing and I want you to be a little bit safe and I want you to be <laughs> cautious uh, don't do that anymore but if you are one of those person but try to go with open source and a privacy focus application like such as this this is privacy focus one and obviously if you want to do ordering notes password protected so you can see open the safe and use the lock icon to protect the note as well you can do a whole lot of things with this one it is a simple note the application is called uh, silent note it is a silent it is a simple and effective for all android user out there give it a try comment down below if you like this application or not or if you want to do something a little bit a different one uh, let's move on to app number three now okay app number three in the list is called nfc tool so if you have or you ever use nfc you read or write any, anything in nfc cards so for example this is a cheap one probably i got uh 10 or 15 of them for like five or six dollars on um, like ebay you can do a whole lot of things it means you'll be able to program this card it, it has zero battery or anything nothing like it never ends by the way you can program this one to whatever you like if, if you have a set routine uh you like to do for instance you want to set up alarm or whenever or maybe you want to keep this as your wi-fi password if your friends and family members visit your house and use this as a business card that you want to give you a url or whatever it's a sky's the limit by the way so this application is best in terms of that so reading is one thing you can find a lot of readers that means that you'll be able to tap it in the back and it will read and writing is something different i can tap this one and you'll be able to see what it's going to read so the nfc you see nfc tag detected so this is a tag number technology whatever whatever and then you have written i uh, have written something which is a 59 megabytes if you can see right here just by one of them so i can just uh, write a wi-fi password and just put it at the house like in the fridge uh, in a magnet and then every time if uh, anybody comes to visit my house guess what they just have to tap it in they get a password voila or you want to do something different guess what you can do it uh, with this one if you press add record you can set up a text uh, add url custom url if you like it if you want to do some search uh, social networking so this is another good one if you want to share this as your uh, card as well like a business card you can do that it's cheap by the way uh, if you want to add a video link to your youtube channel or to your uh, social media account uh, you want to add some file that means 
the Dropbox link and things like that or application record. So you can click on that one. You can um, put whatever application record you will select the application. You can see right here, whatever application you want selected and it can actually do, trigger that at the same time. You want to make this as a contact, phone number. Trust me, it does everything. Uh, for this demonstration purpose, I'm going to press text. I will say uh, hi and then I'll press OK. Now what I want to do, I need to uh, write this one. You see right here, it's a nine megabytes. I press write, bring the NFC card next to you. I write this one and then approach the NFC card and guess what? It's in slowly, it has written completed. So this is an easy way. Again, you can write and copy paste, whatever you like it. Again, in terms of task as well, you can set up an automation task for network as well, sound, media, display. If you want to go a little bit advanced in that term as well, you can do that and root. Again, you want to do something different like in terms of task, airplane mode, GPS. If you have a rooted device, but I would not recommend you to do that. You can do a whole lot of things as well. Battery notification, various tasks uh, at the same time. You can send a composer email. Uh, you can write a tweet at the same time, which is AKX. Twitter, if I want to uh, call that way, you want to sleep. Like, trust me, it has a lot of things, but you can see there are a lot of pro pro feature at the same time, but this actually works. Everything works for general population like you and me. I can just put this one as my Wi-Fi password or put this one as my video link to any of my friends, family members, or anything in general, I can write it with this one. So this is a great application. Okay, app number four in the list is called a Healthy Battery Charging. So healthy Battery Charging, this is a great application you can install on a device. You should not go higher than, in terms of charging, go higher than 80 percent and there are a lot of device that has built in on it but a majority of the time what happens is like if you plug it in and charge and you forget about it guess what you have to do charging 100 percent it's not going to affect for anything but as far as i'm concerned like uh, based on my uh, experience i believe 80 percent is the max threshold you should charge the device and uh, beyond that point you shouldn't charge it in terms of lithium ion battery but the technology has changed and things like that but keeping that inside in terms of myth and everything i'll recommend you to install this in a free and open source again it's a this app is uh, free and open source so doesn't um, hold any of your information so what it does is every single time you have certain uh, threshold that means you can set up a low uh, notification that means you if your battery percentage sits under say five percent it will notify you obviously any device will do that but but now if you are plugging and charge and you are setting that you're setting a bar which is 80 percent bar guess what every single time if it's 80 percent it will notify you so that way you will get reminded and um, in a certain time um, obviously of the day or maybe after night to unplug that uh, the charge. Samsung does have a feature in built in and it battery health in terms of battery percentage uh, charging wise to uh, set to 80% as well. So uh, obviously give it a try. Comment down below if you like this um, idea or not, or if you like this application or not. So let's move on to app number five. Okay, app number five in the list is called SD Made. SE. So SD made SE. This is a great application for all Android users out there. If you are installing and uninstalling your application and day in, day out, every single time, guess what? You need something like this. And uh, you want to make sure your uh, storage is obviously scanned properly, storage is obviously uh, cleaned properly. So if you're installing and uninstalling a file or any sort of application, guess what? It will leave something called cache or uh, like a dead corpse file on the site. So this application will actually help it. And then in terms of system cleaner, like in a, you know, a CC cleaner if you have installed this one on here and any of your uh, Windows device and by the way you can comment down below if you have used a CC cleaner on your Windows device I've used that one that was my first technically application introduced to me in an IT career um, a system cleaner and app cleaner as well your data being to specific app you can scan that app um, a duplicator so this is a great and best help so if you scan this one guess what it will f go and it will find anything that's duplicate on your own device that's the best one so this obviously you can go you press view you can see there's a lot of things that duplicates at the same time guess what it will, you can select it delete it entirely up to you app control and then you can see or what sort of um, app uh, memory it has what sort of obviously a force if you want to stop that one um, show the settings open app and app store uh, execute the app or delete or not export the app at the same time. so you can uh, get the apk file out of here at the same time so this is what it has obviously storage analyzer you can analyze the storage and you can do schedule at the same time if you want to um, set for every, like a, a, this is just a default one every three days you can schedule to be disabled if you want it but you can just schedule enable so now or if you want a corpse finder or just a system cleaner or app cleaner and it actually does in a certain time frame at the same time so this is a great application again comment down below if you like this one or not um, recently i started using this application guess what i love this application and i believe that this should be one of the um, must have application on your device at the same time so again you can see right here 7.6 gig uh, to be free
read at the same time just by pressing one scan and obviously you'll get a 7 gig out of your device that means it's a lot of things at the same time anyway that sums up my total top five must have crazy and controversial app out there guys and if you like this type of video guys smash that like button consider subscribing and share with your friends and family members and comment down below if you want some certain application to be featured on this channel or if you are reaching out to uh to find some certain application as well comment down below i'll definitely gonna give you a guide or help with that one and by the way guys be happy stay safe this is genius x6 signing out peace